Unraveling the Complexity of Women's Emotions Post-Breakup. Written by Tanya Renee Anderson. Narrated by me, Nicole. The realm of post-breakup emotions is a tapestry woven with threads of longing, pride, fear, and societal expectations. Particularly intriguing is the phenomenon where women, despite harboring a deep desire to reignite the flame with their ex-partners, opt to conceal these feelings behind a facade of indifference or even hostility. This intricate dance of emotions unfolds against a backdrop of pride, fear, vulnerability, societal expectations, and a desire to project strength. Let's explore this paradox by diving into the psychological nuances that drive women to internally yearn for their exes while outwardly displaying hostility. Number one, pride and ego. Pride, a double-edged sword in matters of the heart, often plays a pivotal role in the post-breakup narrative. As relationships unravel, egos are bruised and self-esteem takes a hit. The aftermath of a breakup becomes a battleground for wounded pride. Women, in an effort to shield themselves from further emotional turmoil, may adopt an external demeanor of nonchalance. It becomes a defense mechanism, a way to deflect the pain that comes with acknowledging the desire to reunite. The fear of rejection or appearing vulnerable can be overpowering pushing individuals to don a mask of indifference. To admit openly that they want their exes back feels like an admission of defeat. Thus, pride becomes a barrier to honest communication, fostering an environment where true feelings remain veiled. Number two, fear of vulnerability. Expressing the desire to reconcile with an ex requires a profound level of vulnerability. It means laying bare one's emotions, exposing the rawness of the heart, and risking rejection or disappointment. Women, despite the genuine yearning for their exes, may choose to conceal these feelings due to a fear of being hurt once again. The fear of vulnerability often arises from the wounds inflicted during the breakup itself. When trust is shattered and emotional bonds are severed, the prospect of opening up again becomes daunting. There's a hesitancy to expose one's emotional core to the very person who, at one point, held the power to wound deeply. The desire to avoid additional pain can lead women to keep their true feelings guarded behind a fortress of apparent indifference. Number three, societal expectations. Societal norms and expectations cast a long shadow over the post-breakup landscape. There exists a prevailing narrative that moving on swiftly and gracefully is a testament to one's strength and resilience. Women, aware of these expectations, may feel the pressure to conform to this narrative. The image of a resilient, independent woman who emerges unscathed from a breakup aligns with societal ideals. The fear of being judged or pitied can drive women to adopt a veneer of detachment. Conforming to societal norms becomes a way to shield themselves from potential criticism or unwanted sympathy. It's a delicate balance between personal desires and the perceived expectations of the world, with many choosing to project an image of having moved on for the sake of societal acceptance. Number four, testing the waters. The paradoxical behavior of wanting an ex back while feigning indifference might also serve as a strategic move, a way for women to test the waters. By creating distance and adopting an aloof demeanor, they gauge their ex-partner's reaction. The hope is that by stepping back, their ex might reveal his true feelings and intentions. It's a subtle dance of observation, a way to read between the lines of his actions without explicitly expressing vulnerability. 
This strategy allows women to assess whether there's a mutual desire for reconciliation without explicitly laying their cards on the table. It's a delicate game of emotional chess, where each move is carefully calculated to decipher the intentions of the other. Number five, independence and empowerment. In the landscape of modern relationships, the celebration of independence and empowerment is loud and clear. Women, often encouraged to embrace their autonomy and strength, may choose to project an image of self-sufficiency post-breakup. Even if they harbor a secret yearning for their exes, they may hesitate to admit it. Acknowledging the desire to reunite can be perceived as counterproductive to the narrative of personal growth. The post-breakup period becomes an opportunity for self-discovery, introspection, and individual development. Expressing a desire to revisit a past relationship might be seen as regressive, prompting some women to focus on self-improvement while keeping their emotional cards close to their chest. Number six, ambiguity and mixed signals. Human emotions are complex and often contradictory. The paradoxical behavior of wanting an ex back while concealing these feelings can create a whirlwind of ambiguity and mixed signals. The internal conflict between the genuine desire for reconciliation and the acknowledgement of the reasons the relationship ended can manifest as confusing behavior. This ambiguity can be further exacerbated if communication is hindered or if both parties are navigating their post-breakup emotions independently. The result is a dance of emotions that leaves both individuals grappling with the intricacies of their feelings and intentions. Number seven, post-breakup growth. The aftermath of a breakup is a fertile ground for personal growth and self-improvement. Many women use this period as an opportunity to redefine themselves, explore new avenues, and embark on a journey of self-discovery. Expressing a desire to reunite with an ex might be perceived as a step backward in this journey. The fear of compromising the progress made during the post-breakup growth phase can dissuade women from openly acknowledging their desire for reconciliation. It's a delicate balance between the pull of nostalgia and the desire to move forward independently, with some choosing the latter to align with their newfound sense of self. In conclusion, in the labyrinth of post-breakup emotions, the paradox of wanting an ex back while pretending otherwise emerges as a testament to the complexity of human relationships. It's not a straightforward dichotomy of either wanting or not wanting. Instead, it exists on a spectrum of emotions influenced by pride, fear, societal expectations, and the intricate interplay of individual growth. Understanding this paradox requires a nuanced perspective, empathy, and the recognition that the human heart is capable of holding conflicting emotions. Decoding the subtle signals beneath the surface involves navigating through the layers of pride, vulnerability, and societal expectations. In the end, the dance of desiring exes is a testament to the multifaceted nature of love and the resilience required to navigate the intricate landscape of the heart. Here, at Spiritual Motivations, the writer of these narratives, Tanya Renee Anderson, and her team of narrators, appreciate all who have come here to view and listen to our content. Thank you for taking the time to watch and listen. We're also on TikTok, so follow us there as well. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Clicking on the notification bell is important, as it will allow you to receive alerts anytime we upload new content. Remember, always stay positive.
negativity does not exist in our world. And we're trying to be the light at the end of the tunnel for all who visit us here.